Dynamic dashboards are a great way for managers and executives and team leads to be able to change the dashboard viewer across an entire dashboard and the reports that are listed on the dashboard. Again, this is great if you're a team lead, if you want to see X rep or Y rep and all of their data on the dashboard. So let's get into it and show you how it's done. So first I'm going to go over to the dashboards here in Salesforce and I have this dashboard with a report here. And now this dashboard right now is looking at opportunities by stage, but it's viewing it as a particular, a particular user, right? And oftentimes you could be viewing it as a particular user or as yourself. But with dynamic dashboards, we want the ability to see it as different users, especially on those uh, reports that are filtering by my records to understand who owns uh, the records, etc. And so all we're going to do here to make this a dynamic dashboard is we're going to go to the edit button under the properties. Uh, a few things you're going to want to check is to make sure that this is in a public folder. You want to make sure it's in a public folder so that any viewer is going to have access to it. And now instead of having the viewer as me or as a particular person, um, or even whoever is viewing it, we want this last option of let the dashboard viewer choose whom they view the dashboard as. This makes it much more dynamic. Again, managers, team leads, they can change who they're viewing it as to see the data as if they were that person. So as I go ahead and hit save, I'm gonna save the dashboard here. I'm gonna hit done here. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and refresh this dashboard. And so again, this, this report is looking at opportunities broken down by stage and it's my opportunities. And what I can do here, you'll notice here, this button here is change is now showing. So right now it's viewing as Ryan. I'm going to go ahead and change and view it as Courtney. And we'll see here how the data then loads. If I refresh here, oh, there it is. So she has a few opportunities in her name. Again, this is extremely useful when you are looking across your team and don't want to build several reports filtered by rep's name and have a dashboard for each rep. This is great because you can have a dashboard that has on the report level, my records. And then across this dashboard, you can change to look at who is looking at this dashboard. So again, this is what dynamic dashboards does. This is how you set it up and very, very useful for those managers, executives looking across team members and wanna know from their point of view what this data is. Thanks for tuning in. I hope this was helpful. Feel free to like and subscribe and get ready for more content coming. Have a good one.